Now the wolf was full. So he climbed back into Granny's bed and fell fast asleep. Then he began to snore. <laughs> he snored louder and louder. A friend of Hunter walking by the house heard the noise and stopped. <coughs> What's the dog? It's very wrong. I stop and see if Granny's okay. The hunter knocked, but no one answered. He opened the door and went in. He heard someone snoring in Granny's bedroom. So he peeked into the bedroom and saw the big bed off on Granny's bed. Look at that earth in Granny's bed. I think he got her. Her. Granny. Her. The hunter cut a hole in the wolf's stomach. To his great surprise, I popped the litter right in it. The wolf didn't even wake up. He just thought that he was having a very bad dream. <coughs> <coughs> Who are you? I'm Little Red Riding Hood. But where's your granny? Here I am. And I climbed granny, tired but happy. Oh my, what a day. Some stones inside the roof. Then we'll have they. They were making. They were making him happy. Happy. So he can't get up. Good idea. Great idea. And they filled the wolf's stomach with heavy stones. He was dreaming a dream about girls and grannies. And when he woke up, he had such a terrible stomach, and he fell right down and died. Is he dead? Oh yes, yes he did. He did. Dad. He's dead. Are you sure? Oh yes, yes he is. Yes he I did. am. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. The earth is dead. Dad. He's dead. The big bad earth is dead. Hooray. He's, He's dead. dead. He's dead. The earth is dead. The big bad earth is dead. This is the end of the story of the girl who listened to her mother most of the time. Good girl, good little girl, she listened to her mother most of the time.